rough train, losers complain. Day one of these Saskatchewan Rough Riders training camps. This is when the real boys have to come out to play. Who's gonna make the team and who's not gonna make the team? You see, I'm not a lot, I'm as nervous as they are actually. You know, the coach has got a lot of big decisions to make, a lot of holes to fill this year. They'll have to slide Larry Dean over to middle linebacker and he's no Darnell Sankey. I'd really like to see them find somebody that can get in there. Dean's running up there in years. Still got Moncrief in there and then uh, Michael Tetz. Moncrief over at the Sam linebacker and uh, Michael Tetz. He's back this season after all last season. He got hurt about the second uh, day of training camp. He's a Canadian and I sure hope he can uh, make it through the season. He's a ratio breaker for us. Uh, another big question is your left tackle. Uh, right now Hawkins seems to be the guy I like but last uh, rookie camp, uh, last day of rookie camp he uh, wasn't even taking any of the uh, smash drills he was standing back so i'm not sure what the story was there but we really need to find somebody to fill that position probably use blake i'm hoping they'll use him in the inside there uh, johnson he was struggling last year but uh, we need some backups in there that's for sure like i'm not really sold on that god bar yet either Actually, Bandy, uh, he stepped in last last year, and he really didn't do too bad a job from getting stuck in the position and not really played much before. And uh, you've got, on the other side, you've got Cooper Richardson. He'll probably be a starter over there. Uh, the other positions that we need badly are that of the left, I mean the defensive ends. We've got uh, Robertson back, but we need one for the other side. We're actually pretty good up the middle. We've still got uh, Mika Johnson, they re-signed. He'll be a real help getting up there in age, but then we got Lanier. He was our big signing as far as I'm concerned this year. He was a guy we desperately need back. He was out last year, but He's a valuable player, that's for sure. And I like Brown up there too. He's He was pretty good and we got Christmas. We actually brought pretty good depth down the middle. It's just on that outside. And at the DB position, we got Marshall. And I don't know who's gonna play the other side. There's Reeves and there's, there's uh, Clemens, Williams, um, Henderson, Webster. They've got a lot to choose from, but we need to find a diamond in the rough out there, that's for sure. And again, I'm sort of nervous about Dean. I watched him the last few games. I don't know if he had lost his eye because we're out of the playoffs, but he was scaring me. He's no Moncrief, and we need a guy that can close in the middle there, that's for sure. And kicking, you know, like it doesn't look like they have much in camp uh, that I saw in the rookie camp anyway. Like, it's like they're gonna go with Vedrick. But um, he, he was struggling at the end of the year too. He started off good, but after a while there, he was shanking him half the time. <coughs> and uh, yeah, it's gonna be a nervous time, that's for sure. Who's gonna be stepping up to take these positions? You know, at the halfback position, we got Milligan, I really like him. He's really a good player. And uh, on the other side, Clark, He's not bad at all either, so they've got a lot of competition out there for him. And at uh, safety, uh, I'm not sure who they're gonna put in there. My choice would be Delkey, because he really played good at the end there. He stepped up big time, but we got Lacombo to go in there too, so we need a Canadian to step up now that Adam's gone. But there's getting to be a lot more guys filtering out here. I'll uh, try to put a video up each day but it depends how busy I get, I get here 
busy time of year with the gardening and stuff. Takes me a bit of time to put these up. Uh, anyway, like and subscribe and I'll try to get some video in there for you of uh, today's action. If there's any good stuff happening, I'll try to report to you. And just, they're all starting there. The coaches are starting to come out now. But again, you know, like it's always the old line. The old line's always the first out here. But there's quite a few more DBs out just today too. Everybody's anxious, they want a job. Now we'll chat to you later. I didn't manage to shoot any video today. I spent most of my time talking to friends that I run into every year at the camp. It's really nice talking to them. They have a lot of knowledge about the game. They had a lot of one-on-ones with the, the defensive backs and the receivers. Uh, the quarterback has nobody rushing him, so he should get a, be able to find somebody open. It. But uh, the highlight, I guess, of the day was uh, Harris connecting with uh, um, Jake Wenicky. I hope that combination comes up lots this year. But anyway, I hope to shoot some more video tomorrow. Thanks for watching and like and subscribe. And we'll see you tomorrow. Go Riders, go!